J'ai regardé le soleil, il était presque doré. By my translator Genevieve Iten. And it, I looked at the sun, it was almost gold. I remember the day I was born, it was cold. I remember the day when my father made me a bow and arrows to shoot at the invisible enemies. I leaned over a bridge in Venice and saw my mirrored six-year expression through Canal Grande's pop glasses. I was 25. I looked at the sun, it was almost purple. I remember I used to break my precious knees while roller skating. Someone wanted to buy them for a dollar, roller skates. I had a window which gave to another window where someone was simulating love. I remember my aunt had a bird which would scream chocolate and people thought she was mad, poor bird. I remember that once I wrote I remember poem and got an award for it. I remember I don't think much of the awards. I looked at the sun, it was almost yellow. I remember I once felt underrated and underpaid. I remember I stopped playing the violin because I thought it strenuous and thought it a method of child abuse, crazy <laughs> violence. I acquired a vermilion velvet cape in London and thought that camp was over trivial. There was a black guy who traded a piece of a voodoo queen's bone for the cape. I was 17. Mm. I peeked through the sun, it was almost black. I remember Moira Roth's face when I mentioned the color of her hair at the Sotheby's auction. I remember my first day in school. Everyone was hiding sandwiches under their desks. I remember long nights of my third pregnancy and my dreams of that school's vomited food. I looked at the sun, it was Chinese red. My grandmother would call me Princess Wu. I remember when she died, we would burn six candles each night, the smell of melted wax. I remember applying wax to different things and having a show of my batiks. A radical poet wanted to buy one of my radical works and I bargained with him until I discovered that he wrote bad poetry. I remember avoiding art history like pest. I remember having several bright ideas, but they were used before I reached the market. I remembered I always abhorred markets and dead little fish in them. I laughed when I discovered that the Maori used shells instead of paper money. I remember I used to laugh at money. I gazed at the sun, it was nearly green. I remember I used to make love in the air. I know I was the air itself. I remember fearing white satin. I shook while reading Gertrude Stein. I remember I was laughing when I stepped on a python under the rock or tree in Nigeria. I remember I cried when Allen Ginsberg shook hands with me and said he had leprosy. I remember. I still wash my hands after every bad performance my friends give. I look at the sun, maybe kind of orange. I remember Flemish paintings in the Russian Museum of Modern Art, which I frequent in my imagination. I remember the day in which my piss turned to silver. I remember the day in which my brain was washed in my laundromat. Yeah. I remember not speaking with my roommate for a year because she thought Wagner boring. I remember biting my nails when Notley said that I is just a word. I stared at the sun and it looked hot. I remember marrying for love but had to go away. I remember I got married for papers but had to go away. I remember I got married for no reason altogether but had to run away. I remember I started baby talk as a form of literary discourse but had to say bye bye. <laughs> I remember I had a dog but he had to go away. I remember my dog was better groomed than some of my visitors who had to go away. <coughs> the sun looked at me, I was almost blue. I remember three specific things which happened in my head. Puerto Rican Mater Dolorosa from a Clinton Street mural delivering a child and ascending to heaven. Two, visions of plastic altars with flowers scattered along northern Italy highways. In my dream, all of Toscana turns into mini California. Three, structural event in which my lover gets high on a recent art theory and I'm enjoying the Toscana of my head. I remember that I don't remember anything. I remember I wanted to learn how to fly and walk through a glass door age 10. I was punished for walking through that door. 
I remember how I felt when Henri Michaud died. I remember how strange it felt to see my father lose his memory. Do I remember how stupid I looked when I lost my memory? I remember how it felt to live the language without its reference. I remember I was shocked to see people being so tired that they could not care less about the language they spoke. I remember that the discovery of movement was breathtaking. I remember I could never relate to the inhibited children. I remember the day when my publisher offered me the services of his psychiatrist. I remember vividly when I took the Staten Island Ferry for the very first time, while Manhattan stood like Tsar Nikola Jewel in the distance. I remember when Zoe got his first electroshock therapy in a hospital. I remember I used to respect silence in theater. I used to study Aboriginal dances. I remember, I don't remember anything. I remember the day when I looked at the sun. It was getting gold and the sky shedding till it turned black. Yes.